So hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Average Joe, and today we'll be looking once again at Train Simulator 2017. So I've been looking through the career scenarios, and I just got uh, the Horseshoe Curve route. So I was looking through something, you know, a decent length. So I found this. I found this scenario. It's called 100. So after an incredible year on the PRR, which stands for Pennsylvania Railroad, you have become one of the most respected engineers. You have been selected to drive a passenger train on a, on a night run around Horseshoe Curve for a special, special portrait. Four trains are scheduled to meet on the curve at a point, at a at which point a light show will commence. Sounds pretty cool. This portrait will be huge publicity for the railroad. Six weeks of preparation has gone into getting. Has. I can't read today. This portrait will be huge publicity for the railroad and six weeks of preparation have gone into getting the right shot well pressure's on boys pressure's on so let's do this CSX C37 virtual rail creations hmm. Alto to 90, 98, 218. Okay, it's time for the big light show and, and multi-train meet on the curve. Let's get all the passengers safely on board here as soon as possible. You have your timings for each mile post. You have your timing for each mile post. It's written on your task list. Don't be late, but also don't be too early. Good luck. I know the timing of this event is very strict, but help. Oh. Guard, let's get all the passengers. All right. I wasn't finished reading the description, though. So here we are in Altoona, uh, Pennsylvania. Uh, ooh, nice passenger cars. Very 50s or very 50s or 40s style passenger cars. Oh, we. Whoa. Oh, we have a freight. We have a uh, freight train attached to the back. It's got a whole bunch of. Um, we got a whole bunch of freight uh, box cars attached onto our backs. Well, and we got a helper engine, which we're probably going to need. Okay, so this is the annoying thing I don't like, I hate about Train Simulator. If one, if both doors aren't on the platform for a passenger car, like, both doors won't open. So, like, this door is on the platform, like, they should, this door should be open. Uh, hopefully they can improve on that in train, on Train Sim World, whenever that's coming out. They said it was going to come out this month in February, but I don't know when it's coming out. What's the signal look like? Uh, is, it, is it green? I think it's green. Oh, this this dude is the uh, guard or conductor or whatever you are. It's, I think it says description was guard. It's on your hat. Oh, it's, it's a it's like a plaque that doesn't say anything on it.
good. The sand will give us more traction on the rails. <laughs> oh, hello. There's some people. Oh, there's a lady out there standing on her porch. Let me go ahead and put up the throttle. We're kind of struggling a little bit. I mean, we're gaining speed, but because of the uh, uphill grade and the weight of our train, it's uh, kind of slowing it down. Let's get a nice pass by. very old, old signals, so it's kind of hard for me to tell because I'm used to modern uh, signals. Oh, it's even got gauge lights. That's helpful. General Motors. Locomotives. So GM locomotives. Oh, there's someone at the control tower. Alright, let's get these engines a run for their money. Oh, there is passenger car views. Oh, nice. Can we? Ch oh, we can't change seats. We can get a nice view. There's someone out there on the turntable. It's a nice view. Of course, I wish these those cars were re were more realistic, like they hopefully will be in Train Sim World, which I'm very excited for. I know that. Here, let's go ahead and slow down a little bit. We don't need to be accelerating this fast. is up here. Yeah, we're going to get there in time. As long as we pass it by 816, we're fine. Oh, yeah, it's not very far at all. Uh, yeah, we don't need a request. Uh, we don't need to go back there. Okay, let's just... I'm gonna go ahead and we just gotta find a throttle setting to maintain constant speed, and I think it's 63%. We'll be good for constant speed, so we'll just maintain this. Or maybe not. Go back up to 75. Oh, that's why, because the grade just increased in. Oh! Uh. Oh, the helper engine's got, oh, helper engine to 8510, to 82, I'm not getting any power, I think there might be a fault, everything all right. Uh, no, I don't got any power either. Uh oh, let me stop the train. Alright, here. Let's see if we can see anything. I don't know what we're supposed to do. Uh, do I stop or do I keep going? Well, I don't think I got a choice but to stop. Uh, Screw it. I'm just going to stop. I just heard Amtrak 769. <laughs> this is the 1950s. Amtrak wasn't around. Um... Okay, like, now what do we do? There we go. Oh, the engine. Aww. For a second, I thought we had the engine back. Oh, wait. Oh, the engine failed. I just have to restart. I just have to try to restart it. Oh, we got it. Let's go. All right, we got the engine running. It somehow shut itself down. That's weird. But all right, let's go. Oh, okay, that's not good. All right, I got it. Woo, disaster averted, I hope. Oh, we missed it. Dang. Oh man. 
Well, we're gonna lose points for that too. But we can still make up our. We can still make up time. Let's give their engine the engine. Let's make sure the engines are running. Although a stress test might not be the greatest thing for these engine for the engine right now, but we'll try it anyway. I kind of wish the passenger cars in this had a more authentic sound. Yeah, we missed it. Yeah. Oh well. Rip. Um, I think that's just a texture glitch. Yeah, I think it's a texture glitch. Yeah, see, there's the top of penalty. Alright, I think we're going to get to the next mile post on time. At least that's what I'm hoping, because we kind of need to. Maybe that's why it said it was going to be 25 minutes. Because with the failure, it kind of made it 25 minutes. I think there's going to be another failure down the road. Personally. This engine, and this helper engine starting to run out of gas. So it's probably going to have to be towed back to Altoona on another train. But, of course, that's probably not going to happen because the scenario is going to end before they do that. But in Trains and World, you can, I guess you can, like, take random assignments or whatever. I don't know. Also, um, I've been thinking since my birthday is coming up and um, I'm going to be getting uh, more money soon. I thought I would do a uh, Let's Play Subnautica series. Because I am really interested in a Subnautica now, so... And, you know, watching Jacksepticeye series is, and all the new discoveries he's made is really cool. So, I think I'm going to start my own series on Subnautica. So, um, yeah, that'll be the newest Let's Play. Uh, the first episode, I hope, will be coming out um, either next, a week from today, which is here in the States, it's Saturday, or next Sunday, it depends. I just have to check. I just have to look at my schedule, or I might even do it um, next Friday. I might just do that. Just yeah, I might just record it right after school and then just upload it on Friday. But I'll have to check my schedule. But all I'm basically saying is, guys, uh, stay tuned for a Subnautica episodes. Keep checking. Um, just keep looking out for the uh, Subnautica video. There we go. Now now we're back on time. Oh, we might be a little bit early on this one. They said not to be early. So here, we go to slow down a little bit. 8500 to 80, 80, 98218. Ted here. I'm feeling fi feeling fighting fit now. Thanks. How are you? How are your timings for the train bed? What does that mean? Is he like detached from us or whatever? What are you gonna do, Ted? Here, let's go and slow the train down. said not to be early either. Oh, there's a freight train. Honk to him. Greetings, sir. Is he moving? Uh, I don't think he's moving. Are you? No, I don't think you're moving. I think you're just a local 
afraid. Alright, now we can put power back on the little engine. Are you moving backwards? He's moving backwards. <laughs> Is he like scared of me or something? That's weird. Alright, well, GG. Alright there, now we'll be on time. To this milepost. Here's the milepost right here. Or actually, on just 10 more seconds. We're gonna hit it on time. Oh, oh, yep. All right, cool. We're on time. Let's go. Yeah, not that much power on the engine. We don't want to strap. We don't want to uh, get that wheel slip again. Oh no, he's not reversing, he's being pulled. Huh. I didn't know that. Oh, here's all the people here at the horseshoe curve. Everyone's waiting for Yeah, this guy's in a helper engine. That's cool. We'll honk to the helper. see it from the passenger train. There we go. Our first passenger car is passing. The end of the freight train. Oh no, this is our first passenger car. This is the one close to the locomotives. I wish this... You know, what I wish for this route is that someone would, like, modernize it. I think that'd be really cool, because then it would be, like, the Norfolk Southern home uh, type. The scenario wasn't 25 minutes long. We're only 18 minutes in the recording. Huh. Interesting. Alright. This... Here we go. Here comes another freight. high-speed boxcar train. Come on, don't be too early, don't be too early. Perfect. We did it. Oh, there's the light show. Ooh, fireworks. Oh, that's really cool. Here. There we go. That looks way better. Yeah, look at that. Here, let me move my mouse out of the way. Oh, it's over. Oh, well. All right, now we just need to head up here. MG Tower to 9821A. What a show, great timing there. The best engineers were chosen for the job and you have done the Penzi proud. The Penzi is the locomotive. Keep keep going to MG interlocking and you can finish up. A f copy that dispatch. Oh, there's no time limit, so we can just head there. All right. Ah, uh, here's the front of this freight train. Oh look, what a great number to have on a locomotive. <laughs> Alright, enough, um, enough jokes. So we're heading in, the, with the direction we're going, we're heading to Johnstown, uh, Pennsylvania. 
I don't live in Pennsylvania. I've never been to Pennsylvania, but I know this route because I, I really enjoy trains, so that's how I know. Well, I mean, I just like I just like machinery in general, if I'm honest. Oh, there we go. Now the helper engine's cut up with the bruise of the train. Anyway, back to the back to the task at hand. Enough about my life. Um. I hope the passengers got a nice view of the fireworks, even over that even with that freight train. That uh, that one coming from Johnstown or wherever. You can see the ooh, the moon looks cool. Here, let's get a picture of the moon. Let me put power up. Let me move over here. That's a nice pic. That's a nice view. MG to 9821A. Your timing was perfect. Our 100th anniversary photograph will be something special indeed. Excellent driving. Why, thank you. 23 minutes. And I got a thousand. Nice. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Here. Where is it? Here, I need to... See. There it is. There's our gold star. All right. Um, well... Um... What else do I want to say? I had some. I was thinking about something, but I don't remember where it was. I was gonna say something right before I went, before I did my little kind of outro routine, you could say. Oh yes, um, there was a. I actually found a video um, uploaded by this guy. I don't remember what his YouTube username is, but anyway, I'll leave the link uh, to the video in the description below. He made a video on my um, my ca assembling the Capital Limited um, scenario, so. He does mostly train sim videos, so um, in I'm giving him my generosity by saying go check out his channel. Uh, he uploads mostly train sim videos without commentary, though. I will say that he doesn't upload with commentary. It's just you know the raw footage of the clip of him driving uh, the trains. But please go check him out and uh, subscribe to him. Even though I don't know him, I'm just you know showing my generosity. But anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to share the with. Let's try that again. Don't forget to share the video with your friends. And until next time, guys, peace out.